<laughs> Alright, so this is kind of the main area of the place. Or leading into the main area. And I'm going to get out my lens of truth here because I know what's coming up. The very annoying part of spiders attacking from the ceiling. Ah, oh, they always get me. No matter what, I'm not fast enough. Actually, I don't think they're invincible yet. Later on, they become invincible. Um, there's another one in here. Yes. Nope. Oh, I'm too used to my... Actually, I'm going to go ahead and switch up the lens of truth in the hookshot here, because I'm used to having them the other way around. There we go. Alright, what do you give me? Hearts? Yes, three hearts. Awesome. Woo! Good... Man, if I didn't... If I had the, uh... The hover boots on, there's no way I would have turned around in enough time. You would have been continuing going that way, and I just would have been dead. I know there's one right here, too. Oh my gosh, they're all over the place in this temple. It's ridiculous how many are here. Okay, let's get through. I believe there might be one more. I'm kind of scared. I'm going to creep. Watch out for the shadows of monsters that hang from the ceiling again. Oh my god, those things are everywhere. Alright, I'm putting them on now, because this will be helpful. There we go. And hover away. Yes. Alright. These things are pretty easy. You just run up against them until they go up. That might kill me. Nope, it didn't. Alright, I'm going to take this guy out real quick. He's pretty easy. With the big Goron sword, you can just spam them and they go down. Really simple now. Activate this. And uh, I'm going to hit up this side of the room first. Because I think it's kind of a dead end. And the only thing that I remember being here is a Skulltilla. So, we'll do that. I feel like I might have missed one already, though. I hope I didn't. Because I would hate to have. Alright, so we got... One of these, as well as... That thing right there. Okay. I'm going to take the arrows to them, since those do a little... What? What? There we go. Dude. Why guy hit me like that? Alright. Hopefully I'm safe over here. I hate that like Whoa, a nice shot. Okay, there we go. Alright, so that's one enemy down. Now we gotta take out these keys. Because they're little buttholes, too. Where's the other one? I know there's one more in here. There he is. Okay, let's see if I can get this right. No, a little lower. Nice! There we go. Good shot. Is that all of them? Or am I missing one? Oh, there's one back here, too. Okay, now is that all of them? Yes, okay. So this room's really easy. Kill all the enemies, and then the door will open, so... Not too much there. I think all we get in here, though, is a gold skulltilla plus a random chest. And... This'll be number one of five. Sweet. Okay, what do we got? We have... A... Blue rupee, and... A... Key, maybe? Key? I'm not sure. No, arrows. Okay, a bundle of arrows. That's not bad. Let's put this thing on, just so I can see where these guys are. I know there's hearts in that corner. I'm not going to bother getting them, because I'm only missing a half. So it's not that big of a deal. Not that big of a dealio. Alright, let's do this. I love this. This is so cool how there's, like, just these giant platforms somehow disappear. And we got to fight this guy again, so let's get rid of that. Spam, spam, spam. You're dead. Ha! Huh. Alright. Ah, on to the point where I was stuck as a kid. This is really funny. You guys will laugh when you, I even laughed when I got stuck here. It's quite a... That ain't gonna work, dude. That ain't gonna work. Oh my god, you are so lucky, Link. You gotta wait until this thing gets to like the very top and then go. Alright, there we go. We made that with plenty of distance. Alright, I'm going to take these things off because I know I'll be running around and s slipping everywhere if I don't. And I'm going to get a bomb out here because I think there is one in the middle of this guy. Holy cow, we've been going forever. I guess we'll just make this a 20 minute or That'll work. Yeah, once I go too far, it's really only smart to cut it at 20 minutes. Makes the most sense. I'll just find a random cutting spot and... There we go, it'll be that simple. Alright, so this is officially the room that I got stuck in. I had no idea what to do in here. And, uh... I actually waited a couple of days, maybe a week, I'm not sure how long, 
I had to wait though until I could go to Toys R Us with my mom and convince her to buy me the guide for this game, which is the guide that I still have, surprisingly, even though the pages are like falling out. But I I have no idea how this confused me because it's very simple. But I guess as a young kid, you know, I was was I even ten when I did this? I don't know if I was ten yet, but. As a young kid, this might be a little confusing, like the concept of pushing this block so that these things can't come down and crush you. It tricked me, because I didn't, I had no idea what to do here. And uh, the crazier part is you get to a point where it actually stops both of them, and I think that's right here, yeah. So now both of them are not going down, which, this room just confused the crap out of me as a kid, let's just leave it at that. And this is where I could not figure out what to do, I got stuck, I had to buy everything and what's going on here oh god random texts so that is this is the spot where I got stuck and the funny part about it was I actually got so stuck that I beat spirit temple before shadow temple and spirit temple is the next temple so think of that I get so stuck in here that I have to beat spirit temple which you can do there's a part where you think you might need the, uh, the hover boots, but you can do it without them. And uh, once we get there, I'll show you guys that. But yeah, so that's what I did since I couldn't figure out what to do here. And now I laugh at how stupid I was because this is really simple. This isn't difficult at all. Then what you do is you can actually climb on top of these things. And there you go. We can wipe out this entire room in one sweep. We got a blue rupee here and. This switch will actually drop a chest in that left corner. And now we can just hookshot to it. It's simple as that. How easy is this? <sighs> simple. I don't know how the heck I fail as a younger. As a young youngster, I guess. A younger. A young in is what I was trying to say. I'm having a very difficult time speaking right now. I'm kind of hungry and that's all I'm thinking about is food. I know. It's stupid, right? And all I have to eat is a stupid Maruchkin instant lunch, or however you pronounce it. I call it Maruchkin. I know some Maru. Mar I don't even know. I always call it a Maruchkin. Sounds cool. No, don't use that. All right. Don't cut me in half because that would suck. All right. This is taking us to wow. Almost like the third quarter of the dungeon right now. Oh no, we gotta do this room first. All right. So. This room is crazy because there's spikes everywhere, and as you can see when you walk over them, nothing happens. So, that's pretty cool. That's the best part about the hover boots. They protect you from stuff like that, because normally you just walk right into them and like would start having a hissy fit. Oh, it hurts. Oh, oh, oh. Alright. And, oh, nice shot. There we go. What else? There's one more here. Ah, against the wall. Okay. Um. Where do we got it? Yeah, right there. No, what? I hit that. There's no way. Okay, so that opens that door, but there's still a chest in here, and I don't know where it is. It's somewhere over here. You probably have to kill to read that, so I don't really want to. I'll do it anyways, whatever. Alright, you're gone. Get my get some fairy power, that's nice. Get a little refill on that crap. <laughs> Link, you're funny. Alright, before he kills me. Good. Okay, that's probably just a bonus chest. I don't think it's actually a key. Probably just like a rupee or something. But, I like to clear everything. I don't like seeing those chest icons on the map. Yeah, blue rupee. Not even worth it. Don't waste your time. <laughs> and what do we got here? Boss? Something? Oh, this room! Oh my gosh, this room is so funny. You have to, like, play basketball with this. Okay, so I know there's a gold skull to the back here. I'm going to grab that real quick. Bam, and bam. All right, so we got, what is that, three now? And I know exactly where the last two are, so we're good. Um, Yeah, I should be able to do this room real quick, and then we'll call it the episode quits if I don't get burnt and die real quick here. Oh, sh get out of my face, you stupid keys. You're dead. I ain't letting you move. And you're dead too. Bam. Okay. So what we gotta do here is we gotta take these bomb shoes. Oh, we got keys. Incoming keys from the rear. Incoming keys from my rear. Huh. <laughs> take the and bomb shoes. Take these bomb plants. The Goron special crop. And play basketball. So we just gotta throw it in there and this should blow up to unveil a key. 
Yep, there it is. Another one of these keys that's just kind of randomly thrown around. It's kind of a ongoing trend with this dungeon, I guess. Uh, apparently I can't leave until I kill the last bat, wherever you are. Where are you? What the heck? Where is he? Where are you, bat? Oh, you're over there now? You stupid little creature. I hate you. Alright, come on, you're making this episode drag on a lot longer than it should. Alright. Alright, come on. There we go, okay, get, get us out of here. Door open. Alright guys, thanks for watching this episode. I'll see you guys next time when we continue off in the Shadow Temple. Peace!